here. If we win by one, I was going to be a happy guy because that's that team's been playing so good, and uh, I don't know why we got to exploit them defensively a little bit. I was really pleased with that. Uh, but I thought we, we did some good things. You know, we, we somehow contained uh, Thompson, and he has been, I, I said he's one of the most improved players in the league. We somewhat contained him, and, and I thought we got the ball into the middle of that zone early into Draymond and, and Ray Mar, and he kicked it out. Uh, Rel made some shots, and then later Kalen made some shots. But I think you also saw a much more aggressive Kalen Lucas, and uh, and he was pretty good <coughs> defensively, and he was aggressive offensively, and and that's what he's got to do. So uh, I'd say we, we took a couple steps with Morgan and with Green, and we got to get uh, Delvon going a little bit. But uh, it was a big win for us against what I consider still a very good basketball team. I mean, we're not 20 points better than them, but just today we were. And uh, I still think Northwestern is going to be uh, a very good team in this league. I really do. Questions? What's the trick to getting the ball in, in the middle of the, of the track? It is a trick because it's not easy to do a heck of a job of keeping it either. We, we started coming from different angles. We started coming from the side. We started coming from behind. We just put a guy in there at the beginning, and that didn't work too good. And, and we weren't great. And then we moved different guys in there. You know, We moved our center in there. Then we moved our forwards in there. Then we, we even moved Kalen in there so we could get a quicker guy. Hopefully, once he got it, he can make some decisions because they swarm me in there. They, they play that zone as well as it can be played. I just thought we... You know, we made some shots today, too, especially summers early, and that made a big difference. But uh, it's not easy to get in there. Tom, did you use the loss to them last year at your place as motivation this week? You know, I really didn't. Uh, to be honest with you, I, I, I used the fact that I didn't think we were playing our best basketball yet, and we got to play better, and, and that uh, to, to win in this league, you got to win games on the road. And, uh, you know, I... I have great respect for Bill, and sometimes, you know, if you don't respect the team, you might use those. I think if you do, I don't, I don't know, I don't use them, because um, when I talked to Kevin before the game, I mean, he almost single-handedly beat us last year, you know, and uh, so he wasn't even playing. But uh, uh, this is, you know, this team gave Illinois all they wanted. They're going to give a lot of people, there are going to be a lot of people here, and they're going to beat some on the road, because they're a team that doesn't seem to mind where they play. I don't think there's any... That's one thing I will say about them. So us beating them here last year pretty good, and then losing at home, I don't think it's odd for Northwestern. Taking Kalen off the ball a little bit, does that enable him to do some things he couldn't do maybe if he had the ball? Well, I, I took him off the ball to put him on the ball, if that makes right. sense. I wanted him off the ball at the point so I could get him the ball in the middle so he could do something. And, uh, uh, you know, when he's playing aggressively and, uh, you know, I mean, uh, been an interesting week around our place, but when he is playing... Uh, more what he's capable of playing. Uh, you know, he's one of the better guards in the league in the country, if you ask me. And now he started making shots again. He started looking for his shots, but he's aggressively started getting to the hole and doing some things. And, you know, he had a few turnovers, but he had, I think, three of them in the first four minutes, and then he settled down. And, uh, but I'm going to have his hands on the ball as much as I can have it on the ball, believe it or not. Uh, and when Corey comes in, sometimes Kay just likes to be able to roam a little bit, too. It takes a little bit off him. Uh, but uh, he's my guard, and he's going to have his hands on the ball as much as he can. Do you attribute any of that of today to, to all the stuff last week, or is that kind of that done? You know, only if, uh, I don't know what the media is like here, only if you go to a practice and you've never seen a guy thrown out of practice, then I would attribute to it. But it's kind of normal, especially at my place. But I think at a lot of places. I mean, uh, as I told our media, you know, there's I think nine banners hanging, and I've been around about seven of the guys that are hanging, or six of them, and... They've all been out, and Gregory said that him and Urban were out, so Kalen's a good company. Can you talk about Darrell and how he's developed this year, how he's progressed? Well, Darrell, I, I, I think Darrell Summers, the last two and a half to three weeks, has probably improved more than he did his first two years because he's made a little more commitment. And if you asked him, if you interviewed him, I think he'd tell you he's lived in the gym the last three weeks. And that's made a difference in his game. I, I, I think Darrell's a guy that sometimes floats, and when he focuses, um, Darrell Summers is really, really good, and yet he hasn't played really, really good. And so um, it's good to see him back when he didn't get that many minutes because he gets in foul trouble because he's like Morris Peterson was. You know, those guys search the campus to find someone they can guard, and uh, sometimes there's nobody on campus. we got 45,000 of them, so it's kind of a tricky deal. But 
but when he focuses in, and uh, he's such a good athlete, he's, he's really smooth and silky, and uh, I think if, if he keeps working at the rate he's working, when he's not with me, in other words, off the court, I mean, in practice, when he wants to come in at night and stuff, his game's going to really elevate.